everyone i am finally back with a curly hair video it feels like it has been forever and as you can see it looks like i haven't washed my hair in forever i've had such an itchy scalp i'm trying to build up the strength to get through this right now <laughs> So using my trusty Strength Print and Restore shampoo by Shea Moisture, I love this shampoo because I feel like it just works very well with my scalp to clean it and keep it moisturised. So this is definitely my go-to when I feel like my scalp is struggling. Once I feel like I've really scrubbed up my scalp and washed it all out, I go for a treatment mask. Um, ideally, I would use my favourite one, which is the Shea Moisture Intensive Hydration one, but I only had this one at the moment. I need to restock, you know how it be. So I put this one on for like three minutes, wash, blah, 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 and then that's when I will start the detangling process. If you're new to the Curly Girl Club, always start from the bottom when you're detangling and go for like a wide tooth comb or finger detangle and don't be too harsh with it because that can lead to breakage and we don't want that. Is anyone else addicted to guacamole on toast because it is literally all I eat at the moment? So I start off by taking my hair out of the microfiber towel. I did rinse my hair with cold water as well. And then I just realized that in the styling process, my hair reacts so much better with products when it is really wet. So I always make sure that I've got a spray bottle at hand to just keep re like wetting it basically, just so the products work better. Once I've clearly got all the guac out of my teeth, I grab the Cantu leave-in conditioner. I love this stuff because it's just so moisturising and it doesn't weigh my hair down. And another bonus is I feel like it defines my curls. I use Cantu products ridiculously. Um, I just use the raking method with this. Uh, I used to separate my hair more like back in the day, but now I just put it into two and rake the product in where I feel like it needs it most. Next up is the Cantu Moisturising Curl Activator Cream. Can I just say the smell of this stuff is literally heavenly, like it could be a perfume or something, I don't know. Um, but this is again another thick cream that is really great if your hair just sucks up moisture because mine does that and I feel like this just keeps that moisture locked. I feel like throughout my routine, I'm basically like separating the curls, make sure all the product gets to each curl 
and constantly scrunching like I'm just doing everything I can to try and get the curls to curl nicely basically and make sure that they're moisturized like, that is just my main goal with my hair routine I don't know if any of you have tried this as I am double buttercream but for ends it is amazing my ends can often look quite brittle and like the curl isn't as good but this cream is so thick there is no room for dryness it is just what my ends need <laughs> So that is my current routine. Uh, oh my God, I'm so sorry. I'm out of breath because I just got up. Like, I don't get it. But this is what I've been doing and I've cut out heat. I'm not using heat anymore just because I'm just trying to go back to the way that I used to do my hair. And this is what I remember. Like, I would just leave it to do its own thing once I've added all of the products that I need to add. Um, and I just do this for volume. So I'm gonna leave my hair to air dry and I will come back to you guys when it is dry. Um, that'll probably be tomorrow, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you've got any more video requests, then please comment and make sure you like this video as well. Thank you for watching, bye.